Revlon lip swatch. I bought this on the plane when I was on the way back from, um, I can't remember which country, but I think the UK, I'm not sure. So I bought this on the plane. You know those people who go, go around the plane selling like last minute presents or gifts? I picked up this box of Revlon lipsticks. I want to give it a try. I thought it had very interesting colors from the box. I hope it works. I've never tried Revlon stuff, not the foundation or anything to do with Revlon. So I'll give it a try and then let me know how it is. And I'll let you know how I like it on my lips. So far you've seen I like Laura Mercier. Uh, let's try the Revlon and see how it goes. I'll start with the 430. So it looks like. Not working guys um i have dark lips i have some spots on my lips so this is not something i'll be using again so that's a for 30 on me pick another one the next one will be better so next i'll pick 205 <laughs> They're not pigmented so if what i do and I, this is what i don't like i don't like mixing lipsticks it either works or it doesn't work so what i do to create the situation i'll try mix it to the brown laura Mercier and see if it works but this is again too much work but let's see we can solve the situation So you see if I mix my Laura Mercier with that, it works, yeah? But then again, why would I buy it? What's the point? So really, it's just something that I'd buy. I mix it with this Laura Mercier Lipstick Rock, you know, they're my favorite. And so the outcome is good, but I don't see the point why I'd buy this and that. You know, I'd rather, rather just buy one, because for me it's just, I feel like it's just a waste. So that's another one. So far, I'm so disappointed. Let's hope I get even one. So my next one is for 57. But so bad for someone who doesn't have dark lips, pink lips, that's a good color. It actually really looks so bad. And I like the way it has this metallic um, thing to it. I'll mix it with something nice. At least one out of three. So next I'll try the 740. It's like a deep red. But um, still not hiding my dark spot, but it's not something that I would say I wouldn't try it. And I think it would work with someone who doesn't have dark lips. So that's a good color. This one is A25. A25, it's called Lover's Coral. And working for me. Keep on saying I have dark lips. Now you see, guys. So that's, I definitely know. I don't even understand you know, what. It doesn't have any pigmentation. So that's a no no for me. Next, I'll do the 460. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. That's a 460. That's how it looks like. Mm, not bad. People who like new lipsticks don't think it's bad. It's not covering my black spot, but it's not bad compared to what I just tried a few minutes ago. I'm doing the 825. That's it. Okay. That's the 825. 
ain't working for me. Uh, so this one is a uh, five thirty five. So that's the 535, it's called the Ram Raisin. Mm. You like it? I definitely like my lips underneath, but it's it's among the most out of all them of them all it has the most pigment, so I really like it. So the last one ladies and gentlemen is 477. It's called the black cherry. Looks like it's the <laughs> wall. But I feel like it's not bad. You can mix it up. Or people who don't mind dark lips, it's who are. Like I think Coco would like this. We really love this. Yeah. So all in all, guys, um, that was the review for the Revlon box. The lipsticks I bought. They're called. It's called the Revlon Travel Collection Exclusive. There are nine of them inside. My favorite was 535. What I have on my lips right now. Underneath, I lined with. I lined it with the brown Laura Mercier lipstick, the Rock. And so, guys, I just advise if you have dark lips like me. Um, it's not something that I'd say is value for money. I think maybe they are made with uh, Caucasian ladies in mind who have pink lips so that they, they're not so pigmented. Although what I like about them, they're not drying. As you can see, they're shiny. Um, they don't make my lips feel dry. Yeah, so that was a review of the Revlon Travel Collection. So guys, let me know what other lipsticks you'd like me to try. Uh, what other products you'd like me to try. I like doing a little bit of everything. You know, if you've noticed on my channel, I do beauty, I do lifestyle. Um, parenting, um, fashion, you know, I be, I'm a firm believer that I'm, I'm not just one thing, you know, um, I enjoy many things and so I feel like sometimes I should get into my world and show you the small little things that make up my world. So lipstick is one of them, I never leave the house without lipstick, so that's why I enjoy doing this, um, lip, the reviews for lipstick. So guys, until next time, bye bye.